everybody, Touch My Night Butler with Hub Games, welcoming you to the next installment of the Civ 6 Saga, where I basically try to destroy the world. In the last video, I had 99 zombie, I had 99 zombie problems. I mean, they just kept coming, and they were coming. Hopefully this time around, we'll have a way to eradicate our zombie problem and begin to fi and finish our uh, battle with the city state so we can finally have our first conquest. So, if you haven't already, what are you doing? Go on down in the, um, the description there and like, subscribe, and check out all the cool things that Hub Games has to offer. All the coolness. All right, and without further ado, well, with a quick break here, we're gonna get down with the gaming so, gamers, let's game after this quick after this quick break. Okay, no, not after a quick break, but gamers, let's game after a quick cut. Editor, do it. All right, and we're back. So we're back. Um, I had a small technical difficulty while I was uh, working on getting this back. The the load up that I did the first time was not in the medieval era for some unknown reason, but this time we've actually already been there. So now that we're here in the medieval era, I can continue my assault like I'm supposed to. So gamers, let's game. I'm trying this again. Nah. We'll get these guys. No! God, darn it. I gotta remember not to click. I thought I learned my lesson from the last time I did this. But no. Apparently, I didn't. Oh, well. No. You know what? I'll just... I'll let you guys stay there. Can I let Arthur Hill? Yeah, I'll let Arthur Hill for a second. In the meantime, in between time, let's take these guys out. Or at least make it easy for Arthur to take them out. And these units will come down and they receive their marching orders. You guys will stay fortified and alert and away we go. It already said we entered the medieval era. What is happening? All right, fine. We'll just vote on this. See what we can get. All right. So even though I haven't met all the world's congregation, apparently these guys have though. We get to vote on things. So this is gonna be fun. Uh, yes, please, because I need my military units to. Um, be able to destroy you guys so i'm gonna vote heavily on this this will allow my units to gain bonuses at least five attack bonus to make them stronger new districts built by this player culture bombs players borders will not grow in culture uh you know what for all the smack he was talking to me alexander deserves this so I'm gonna spend some coins. I'm gonna spend some diplomatic points there. And there we go. Alright. Well, I won one, lost one. Hey, that works out. 
All right, ongoing competition. Appease the gods. The gods have warned us the end of the world is coming. They will grant their followers boons, but we must first pr prove our fervor. Only the most zealous will be rewarded. The members are competing to see who gets the highest score. To gain scores, use the sacrifice adjacent unit action with their suit ser unit. Gain an equal uh, gain a score equal to the combat strength of the sacrifice unit. Huh. Oh, I guess I gotta start using suit sayers. Well, I guess. If that's what the game wants. I hope that unit's not trying to come for Arthur, because they're gonna be in for a rude awakening. Because Arthur don't play those games. Especially when he has more units at his disposal to come forth and defend him. Mm. Let's build a trap here. I'm, I'm tired of the zombies. I really am. And before y'all call yourselves attacking poor old Arthur over there while he's in his weakened state. Alright. If you if you if you if you if you have any girl problems, I feel bad for you, son. Okay, hopefully all the madness that was over here will stop and I can actually do a surprise attack this way. So here we go. Alright, I have an envoy at my disposals. Alright, Constantinople, get going with your production. You tread on dangerous ground by making common cost for I like for you to come at come get some. And you threatening me, come get some. I will gladly show you what we are about. Herald uh of uh, whoever you are, just come get some. Cause I'm not scared. I've decided I'm going to, you know, wage war in every every place that I can, and I will attack you with no regard. So if you want some, come get some. Cause when I move my turn. Special session of the World Congress. What for? Oh, it had nothing to do with me. A military emergency. We cannot stand if we do not. Oh, so apparently, uh, this particular guy, Mathis, has apparently been um, doing the same thing that I've been doing. Yeah, I have no vote. I haven't met the man. I don't know what the man is doing. Next. Now I'm going to go with them next. Boys, take them down. You turn me into liars, fellas. You turn me into liars. Oh, there are zombies. Fellas, go get the zombies. Oh, I even realized that. Uh, all right, well, that's some news. There's a barbarian camp not too far from where we're fighting. I guess I should have paid attention to that. So it looks like I have to take care of something besides the zombies. I 
Yeah, I'm not even about to be afraid at this point. The more afraid that I get, the more likely I can't get to where I need to go, so I just gotta do it. Those poor guys declaring war whenever you need. Who do you guys think you are challenging the king of the round table? Yeah, I know who he was. All right. I just cleared those out. Those zombies are really after it. But that's okay. I can't let you get your uh your fortifications back, so Arthur, I need you to ride on down. Alright. So how's everybody here? And I'm sitting here focusing on world domination and kind of forgot to say something. You know, me, I've been all right. You know, chilling, working hard at, at the job, working hard on trying to get content together for you all. But yeah, you can kind of say I've been somewhat busy. Busy, I say. Can I not? I didn't. I was hoping there wouldn't be any repeats of the way things went the last time. But apparently, the game is like, nah, bruh. See, you, you did all this to yourself. The more units you kill, the more these zombies will show up. So, you gotta learn how to deal with it. <sighs> okay. I'm gonna just need to use Arthur to basically take this land. Yeah, it's gonna be all on Arthur. Because I feel like if I don't stop the zombies here. There are going to be more problems. Alright. The zombies are gone. Again. I'm going to level you guys up. Again. I'm going to go ahead. Oh no. They, they just. They don't move. Because they attacked. Uh, yes. You guys can attack the city there's somebody out there probably oh no <sighs> definitely yelling at their screen like what am I doing and the answer is playing the game it may not be the most optimal way to do it considering that I keep spawning these zombies and complaining about them not that I spawn them deliberately it's a byproduct of me defeating my enemies, as they say. Yes. Defeating my enemies to crush them within my hands. They cause more enemies. So, yeah, that's the, the route that I have to deal with. We. But the good news is, hopefully, I have some Navy support that can help speed things up and perhaps slow down um, some things a commercial hub would not be helpful in this city 
I could put a harbor in here. That would be helpful. Oh, yeah. Let's go ahead and make that money. That plus four for a harbor. More money means more units. Oh, yeah, I forgot about this. More money means more units. More units. Look, would you just, uh, would you attack them? More units means more power. More power means I can destroy my enemies. Yo, what's up, King Arthur? Sir Mixalot. Sorry, every time I think about I think about the the round table every now and again, it comes to mind about the Adult Swim um, segment where they uh, did a version of um, Baby Got Back, but with King Arthur and the Knights of the Round Table. One of my favorite Adult Swim skits. Okay, so that was in the group that got destroyed. I wonder. If I try going around, will that work? Table B round. Would you attack them? Continue on. And with that new proportion by Arthur. Oh! Arthur hanging in there strong. And spreading the word of sea turtleism. I almost got about that. <laughs> Arthur showed him who's boss. I thought Arthur was definitely dead. But Arthur's like, nope. Not. Yep, they show back up, they did. Hmm. Do do do. Well, Arthur finally get me out of this war so I can focus on the, the... Yes. We've done it! We've annihilated the city-state. Finally. One stop on the road to world conquest. Time to heal. And get you on land so you can heal. Now I honestly don't remember something that I that's important because I have a very important decision to make and I don't remember if I actually um if I actually said I was gonna do that or not. But oh well. Here goes nothing. Causing pain for my enemies. Sleepy time for my enemies. Alright. So we're gonna try this again with them. Stay away from my land, please. Hold on. They have an ability to attack. So uh, let's wipe out these zombies. Or try to wipe out the zombies. It's great. All right, well, population three number of districts, raise it to the ground. 
<sighs> Perhaps not the best of moves, but I think, I think I remember saying that I was going to raise stuff to the ground, so. And if I didn't say that, then, yeah. Your pursuit of power always, always and only power, but hungry will resist you to the bitter end. I will declare war on you, sir. Invincibility lies in the defense, the possibility of victory in the attack. Mm -hmm. Sun Tzu. All right, let's see. Reduce maintenance by one, we need that. Production of units, we got that. Production towards builders, we have that. Housing in all cities with two specialty districts. That will come in, that's coming in handy to make sure that we actually have housing. But I have to ask myself, will something else be better? Let's build our production in all the cities. Yeah. All right, author, you deserve a good rest. And you, my friend, you'll go journey back with them. You've earned your next promotion. Feed in the landia. Methadone. I wonder who's this down here. Oh, it's one of the places I haven't met yet. Cool. This would be kind of funny. Like, we finally meet them and then, oh. We finally meet them and then it's just, you know, we come to declare war. <laughs> Probably would have been a good idea to keep that land then. Hindsight is always 2020. That's okay. That is a okay. All right, so I think I know what I'm going to do build a catapult. Let you guys heal. I'll get you guys to attack them. Heal. Destroy. Destroy. And hire another governor. Governor. Wow, these secret societies would be coming in handy right now if I got the right one. Let's see. Wait, how many cities do I have? We only have three, right? One, two. Yeah, only got the tree. Okay. Come on back to the governors. So let's just promote this one. Great citizen, great uh, uh, citizen points will work out. Yeah. Yeah. All right. And the beat goes on. There will be no place for you at Odin's table. You are a disgrace. Okay. 
Like I told you before, just bring it. All right, military engineering. The more science intervenes in warfare, the more will be the need for engineers in the field armies. In the late war, there were never enough sappers at any time. Ladies and gentlemen, this little thing right here, the night there, is going to be the beginning of the end for the game. If I can continue to research, if I can research enough stuff fast enough. So with that said, all right. Wow. Arthur and the crew are surrounded. Hmm. Alright. We'll destroy these guys. I need... Oh wow, there's some right outside where I need it. Huh. I need to move up. Oh, hey, they built the ship. Ain't that lovely? You know what, ship? I'm going to give you a, a particular special ability of just go wherever. That was supposed to be for this thing. I'm gonna give you the grand old ability to go wherever you want. I'll fix that mistake later. All right. I need to kill these guys so I can get rid of them. So I can get my resource and be free. Free to run amok. Speaking of, let's purchase some land, shall we? Purchase an item. Purchase a tile. Now we're not going to wait that many turns. We want it now. And I'm going to purchase an item. Let's go ahead and build us a, u uh, a uh, builder unit. One more item. Let's see. Ooh, I can purchase suits there. Well, hello. And let's go. Opening technology. Can I not sail the seven seas already? Wait a minute. Nope. So I can't sail the oceans yet. Okay. Production of machinery. We'll go for machinery. And we'll continue. What shall we make right here? With the imagination in the barn you bag. Let's see what we can make today. Yeah, you guys were, are like the most sittingest of ducks. So it's gonna put you back here with Arthur. How can you let those barbarians run amok so close to your home? How can you shut up? can build an improvement here. I guess. Better than letting them take it. They are still healing.
That's the builder. Sacrifice a decent unit. Must be adjacent to a friendly combat unit, which is adjacent to an active volcano. Wow. Must be on a tile that could be affected by natural disaster. Alright. So. I got a problem. According to the map, I'm nowhere near a volcano. I just wasted that. Huh. Well then. Okay. Things that I didn't think through. Fortified till healed. Let's go. My unit's taking them down. Taking them down. Now with the circulation, we can have nice conversation. And you know that we cannot fail when you for the Holy Grail. Three, three. Gonna move him over. We'll get our we'll we'll get our gunpowder, so we can just go on about our business, and we'll just defend there. I'm gonna move these guys up. More zombies appeared. Jeez, King Arthur cannot catch a break in these parts. How many zombies will King Arthur have to put down before he's free? If I were again beginning my studies, I would follow the advice of Plato and start with mathematics. All right, so part of my plan has actually is about to change. And it's mostly out of necessity than it is out of um, anything else. Because I can't seem to stop these zombies from coming. It's like I knock one set down and, um, and then more appear. Swiftly, might I add. So it's not that they're just appearing, it's just, you know, they seem to show up and they show up in, well, hordes. I guess that's to be expected since, you know, they're zombies and all. Brains. Hey, look, there's a there's a volcano. What is this thing? And what? Oh. Okay. No, that's the Macedonian soothsayer. Well, what are they doing? You know, I'm kind of 
kind of worried. Wow, there's no way. All right, I have to stop my soothsayer and actually make them go in a whole different direction. That's fine. Everything's fine. Arthur proving why he's the best. Of course, I still can't do anything else with him because I keep trying to get him to heal him. Well, things keep happening. That's 11. This will take nine moves. I only got three turns. Yeah, I'm not even be, not even about to be worried about that. Let's just go. We got them. Let's raise this place to the ground. I'm gonna keep these guys here just in case, so we'll let you sleep one night in the open there. Have you guys link up. Hmm. What if I'm alert? Sleep. Huh? There's nothing over here for me to do. Let's continue on. Really, Macedonia? Really? A war with the zombies and a war with the, a city-state. Hmm. I'm already fighting zombies. They already hate me. Glad you feel that way. Now we're not ready to make peace yet. Probably not going to make peace at all. Now, if you guys don't mind, I'm still in your unit. Will I come to regret that? We'll find out. But the one thing I do know is that with my new unit, I can do something else that I've been meaning to do. I mean, I can't protect them. Oh. Oh, no. Can I do something with my unit? No. Hmm. Oh, something you guys didn't get a chance to see when I was doing this the, the last few times. These are lower these little these little flags with the minus symbol. Those lets me know that with those tiles will net me minus loyalty to any city that's close by. So it exerts certain pressure. So my guess is because Alexander's Macedon is so close that it's exerting a lot of pressure to where if I built the city right here where this Cellular unit stood, my city would almost immediately become a free city. So I definitely need to be careful about how I, uh, what I do with my newly acquired uh, settler, because I'm gonna need another. I'm gonna need another city. And thinking about what I was trying to do, I believe. The plan was for me to um, not have to use very many of my own settlers, but to settle using their places. I think. 
Did my unit die or something? Run, settler, run. I need you to get as far away from here as possible, or possibly as close to Arthur as possible. And I need you guys out of the splash zone, so I'm gonna let y'all protect them. And we are going to disperse this clan. Vampires! But we don't want them there. So I take it because... I mean, why, why aren't they able to move on their own? Hmm. Yeah, the guys at home got these, these zombies, so that's fine. It's more than fine, you know? I'm, I'm doing great. Doing fabulous. Well, the city-state of Venice has now become has been established. And that's good. Attack! Defend the homeland from zombie demons. So Venice was established uh, south of where I am. Well, that's fabulous. Good job, Venice. Go ahead and heal. <laughs> And have you guys continue to sail the coast. Might as well go ahead and map the entire world while I have the chance. Oh hey, my harbor's done. Nice. Hey there, Venice. How's it going? I know you don't know me at all, but there might be a possibility that I'm going to come over and, you know, take your stuff. But in the meantime, we could be peaceful. I don't see why we couldn't. Neato, it's done. The first of many. Anything but that. Do I have... I can build a Colosseum. That's not going to help me much with anything other than culture. Colosseum. Don't think I want to do that. You know what? Another builder would come in handy right now. So let's try... Actually, another ranged unit would come in handy right now. Let's go ahead and make some archers. Let's go 
Let's build a lighthouse there. And attack. Why did I unlink them? No, a fool well, I need them to stay together for what I'm about to do. I'm smart man. What just happened? Yeah, I was nowhere near winning. Uh oh. They are surrounded in it. Fortify until healed. I need you guys to continue marching downward. Just long enough for me to get that established. The things that are not true. Is Mr. Calm? Mr. 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 Calm. Is Mr. Butler Calm? He seems like it, but he's not. He most definitely is not. You've, you're kidding me, right? Let's go. At this point, it just makes no sense to just wait around and, and wait. We just have to be E E aggressive. Y'all really thought y'all was gonna take it down, King Arthur? Silly rabbits, tricks are for kids. The silly rabbit tricks are for kids. You can totally heal there, Arthur. And <sighs> can't believe I did all that. I raised that city to the ground only to build another city there. Sail free. Huh. That created a dust storm. The first time I've ever done anything like that. Unlink. No, I'm gonna have you guys move back up north. Do as you see fit. <laughs> All right, where are we going to send you? Send you across the way there, shall we? So you guys don't want to fight me. I can live with that. 
accept it, I won't. And then you. Oops. Yes. All right. Spreading trade routes will help spread the religion as well as help me gain some money, which is something that I'm kind of in need of. Oh, it's you guys again. Definitely gonna cause another one of these natural disasters for you all. After what you guys did to me the last time I was over in this area. I don't know how I forgot about good old methathone. Methathone or whatever they're called. Far so good on the zombie front. No more zombies have appeared. All right, author is back on his feet. That's what I'm talking about. Cause we got work to do. You know, in this entire time, I forgot that I'm actually in the middle of a war. Wouldn't seem like I was in the middle of one, considering that I'm far away from my opponent, but I'm actually in the middle of a war. Huh. Rocks in my path? I keep them all. With them, I shall build my castle. I had to say something about not running into very many zombies on this front. Let, let these guys fight the zombies now. Thank you, game. You're welcome, bro. and King Arthur's just over there minding his own business. But since you guys want to fight, walls. I just realize they haven't been fortified this entire time. Man, if anything would have happened to them. If anything would have happened to them, there's nothing I could do about it. Hi, Arthur's back again. You know. 
just doing his thing. When you have the Holy Blade, you can smite anything, apparently. Of course, it's not good that Arthur's dying. All that glisters is not gold. Often have you heard that told. Do I want to change anything? Changing palaces. I haven't had to build any units, any builders in a while. Although I do need to be open. Hadn't had to build any unit. I haven't had to build any builders in a while, although I need to build one soon, but I can't pass it up because I was just talking about how much I needed more science. So, go for the science. King Arthur only has four turns left to live. Let's make them count. Oh, hey. Well, I guess Alexander got you. Now they're doing my bidding. Only three housing. You know what, Arthur? You did well. Hey, I got the epic Arthur. Yay. All right. Welp. Arthur's gone. It's a sad time for Constantinople. East to the west and to the west back to the east to the west. Uh. Wow. I think we're going to try to experiment with this video. Of, unless it's like a major event, just chopping it up to where it cuts to each of my turns just to see if that style works better especially since a lot of these turns have been silent so you know if you get to this part of the video thank you so we are actually what 29 no 27 almost 28 turns in an hour and 26 minutes of recording yeah I want to try it out just oh and it's even my turn it's a nice looking monument they got there It'd be a shame if anything would happen to it yo what's up king oh snap here we go just when I thought I was free <laughs> The zombies washed up on the shore like come on come on come on uh, ain't no time to turn squeamish c -c 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 come on. we swear on upon our spores when you're gone the world will be yours yours yeah 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 All right, Congress again. All right, so the chosen player generates percent. All right, so, you know, I kind of need this favor. So I'm going to spend a lot of points on that. I hope that it passes.
and I still need melee to do its thing. So, here's hoping that my bills pass. And the chosen player generates 100 or more grievances. Well, that one didn't pass, but it wasn't pointed towards me, so that's good. Um, but the other thing passed, so that's good too. I have two diplomatic uh, points, if I'm not mistaken. No, that's diplomatic favor. There's certain things you get for me. Ah, diplomatic victory points. Ten of those, and I can win. But I'm hoping not to win with diplomatic victory points. Tis the hope. Go ahead and free these zombies from their um, their sorrow. <laughs> Although more have come to bring me sorrow. Let's just go here. Let's move. And move. Oh, that's Machu Picchu. Nah. Ah, the free city method. Oh, so they succumb to pressure. Okay. I thought they freed themselves again. It looks like this time they actually, they were just joining. I came out. Yes, I did. Shoot another zombie. Yes, I. It's all on my mind. See, I shot that zombie. This is build a crossbowman. Get it over with. Oh yeah, I could bring Arthur back if I wanted to. It's not a bad idea. I think next turn I just might. If they let me. Stay down. I didn't mean you light. <sighs> These zombies are always a problem. Yeah, definitely a problem. There is no easy way to train an apprentice. My two tools are example and nagging. I get the feeling that after they killed my... Yep. <laughs> they killed them and turned them into zombies. A ranged unit's definitely going to come in handy for what I'm about to attempt. Which is going to happen about now. -ish. Attack. If you thought we were leaving you alone, you were mistaken. 
We just needed time to build up our defense. All we needed was a crack. A small crack. Now that's not cool, bro. I'm over here trying to steal this land and these zombies appeared. Let's guarantee our victory, shall we? We'll be taking this land if you don't mind. No more free states for you. Nah. Am I going to regret that later? Probably. But it's better to have to deal with one major headache in an area than to deal with two of them. Because all that needed to happen would have been for me to say, yeah, I'll keep it. And then the city became a free city. Then it's the worst case scenario. So. We'll just continue our war. Stone wall braves, let's do that. And just like new day popped up again. Oh, yeah, I can move my trebuchet. Sheesh. Skip your turn just this once. I'll let you heal a turn. Let's move you guys up. See what we're looking at here. Oh, my! Well... Ah, here it is. Hello, author. Welcome back. Just need to move you somewhere a lot closer. You have a job to do. You have a job to do. But first, I need to get these guys out of your way. So I'm going to move them. So that way, you can move further south. Because like I just said, you have a job to do. That's okay, guys. You're doing great.
You're doing great, sweetheart. Okay, wait. Bananas. All the filthy bananas. Alright. Let's work it out. Take them two turns to get in the water. Alright, my first questing night. Who can move a whole lot faster? 12 turns? Hey, let's do it. Oh, and Arthur can still move? That's so beautiful. Brings a tear to my eye. This away, that away, this away. That away. Please stop with the zombies, man. My units cannot take it anymore. He says, now knowingly throwing a unit towards battle. Several units towards battle, really. Yeah, I know it didn't do anything, but it's what we got. Exactly what I expected to happen. Actually, that's not a bad idea. I forgot that I could come around the side. Questing night away. King Arthur's on his way. Here to save the day. The medieval era. It's going to be my finest. Finest hour, and the moment I get my hands on hunger, it's gonna be a wrap. They built the trebuchet too. Sorry, Alexander, you've been marked for destruction since the beginning. And to make matters worse, is I might, just for the sake of it. For all the fun of it, destroy your once beautiful capital city. What is happening here? Oh. You lived free. Hopefully that wasn't large enough to where it would have affected my units. It did not. <laughs> uh, what an idiot. 
Oh, never mind. No, I'm not. Arthur, by the off accidental chance that I needed to do that, it worked out in my favor. One trebuchet blast. Ah, ah, ah. Two, two trebuchet blasts. Ah, ah, ah. Hold up a second. Quest of night. Nah, bruh. We're gonna put you closer. Ah, ah, ah. Swordsman, attack. Ah, ah, ah. Hadn't have done that. Owie! Stop hurting my trebuchet. I like to say it didn't do you anything, but I know the truth. The Holy Sword smiting enemies yet again. Smiting enemies so mightily that he was able to climb a mountain on horseback. Phew. Alright. Let's get some of this production and stuff up. Sheesh. Trebuchet. Attacky. Questing Knight, attacky! Trebuchet, attacky again! And finally, Swordsman, give me this capital city. Seven girls were chased by bears. <laughs> the bears were just about to catch them, and the girls jumped on a low rock. One of the girls <laughs> prayed to the rock, Rock, take pity on us. Rock, save us. The rock heard them and began to grow upwards, pushing the girls higher and higher. Wait a minute, is he gone? Just as quickly as it began, my long march finally comes to an end. Oh! Oh, well. I got rid of Macedon. Not sure how excited I should be about this, but they're gone. They're gone. Hula, baby. Shake her. Yes. All right. Anyway. Well. Considering that, you know, there's no need for me to raise it to the ground. I'm going to go ahead and keep this sucker. Yo. -hoo! Let's repair that granary. And for Arthur, we'll just, you know, let him be Arthur. And I just get the feeling that I might need to keep a defense nearby. Gonna get us some whale tonight.
None of that is good. Love it! Oh! Hey! How's it going? Um. Hmm. Let's just be nice to him. For now. We are surrounded by the zombies. You know what? We're doing it again! Get on quest ignite. <laughs> Attack the city quest ignite. Sinbad, sailor of the seas. Questing Knight is putting in some work. Yeah, yeah we're raising for the ground. Alright, I got 10 turns before the medieval era is over. Um. I don't know where you came from, but okay. I really need to find hunger and get them out of this game. Still have my zombie problem. Again. Listen, strange women lying in ponds, distributing swords is no basis for a system of government. You can't expect to wield supreme power just cause some watery tart threw a sword at you. Hmm. So we go on to the next level. Yes, yes, we shall. We have become a monarchy. Wahahaha. All right. The quicker we can use some of those great scientists, the better. Him that overcometh, will I make a pillar in the temple of my God, and he shall go no more out. Mm-hmm. 
Uh -huh. Don't sleep through dreams that can't come true. Five turns, three points. Will he be able to make it? Will he stand the test of time? Will these zombies ever stop attacking him? Edessa is in danger because it has nothing to protect it at the moment. Other than the city walls. Man, they are not giving up. Whose bright idea was it to put the zombies mold into this? Better yet, whose bright idea was it to put the zombies mold in Ooh, that didn't stop me from putting it's my bright idea. My point is, why, why did I do this to myself? Three turns left. Two points, two turns. One point, two turns. Sorry. I got Hercules. Hercules, Hercules. Speaking of, um, bro, you, you, I originally wanted you to make buildings, but, um, you're better suited down here to help with the zombie problem I got. So, Hercules, Hercules. <laughs> Where is it? I found hungry, so I was right. <laughs> I found him finally, I found him. You know, just this once, because I don't know where your actual home base is. But hungry must go. Who on earth discovered this? Sinbad, is that you? Sinbad. <laughs> wow. I Hercules, I kinda commented you for a reason. So, um, go out there and do good things. So it looks like, it looks like, it looks like what it looks like. I may not actually get that, uh, that last one after all. Mm. 
Man, I was hoping. Man, I was hoping, I was hoping. <sighs> oh well. A dark age comes. Tis nothing but nothing for me to do but just to wait it. A point off. Welcome to the Dark Age. Oh boy. Well, that'll do it for the medieval era. Which is both good and bad. The, uh... So the good news, we got rid of Alexander. The bad news is we ended up in the Dark Age. Right as we found Hungary. And our cities, our cities are gonna probably be less loyal to us for the next era. So I have to act fast to keep them from becoming free states and having everything fall apart on me. So next episode is gonna be fun. The Renaissance era, dark. So yeah, the Dark Ages. Well, everybody, it was a long run, actually three hours for that particular era, and I was tired. So I'm going to cut it here again. Um, hopefully the editor that was taking notes and actually made the cuts as suggested. Of course, that's me leaving notes for me and basically cutting chopping it up to where it's basically just my turn for most of the video so that way you didn't have to endure the whole two hour video of just waiting on my turn so here, here's hoping and if you guys enjoyed that after watching this video uh, let me know and I'll continue to move forward with um, the game in that regard um, but uh Thank you guys so much for watching. Again, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to see more. And um, don't forget to check out the links in the description below to see all things Hub Games. And until next time, gamers. I am the thankful Tashmanite Butler saying, gamers, let's game. And yes, the glasses thing was done for no reason at all.